Hi there. This time as a part of the user form learning exercise, we will see the utility of multi-page control. Now what is that? Let me show you an example. If I run a particular form which I have made and it shows me various text boxes asking from me my details, my first name, last name and the email. Now notice, now if the user form had a lot of text boxes, it would have been very difficult to manage them in a single page. So for that, I have this utility which allows me to put multi-page tabs under which the different text boxes appear and they ask for user input. So for example, if I write the name A and then press tab key, letter B, and if I press Alt O, why Alt O? Because that will allow me to go to the next tab, other details. And if I give them email, A at the rate gmail.com. And if I say transfer, notice the data gets transferred in the three columns, A, B, C. And what if I press clear and I go to personal details and I, this time let me give a different name, X, Y and other details, let's say A at the rate, in fact, A, B, C at the rate gmail.com. And I say transfer. Foo. So one by one, the data get transferred and it's very easy for the user to input all the details which appear in different tabs. So in the next video, we'll see how to create this multi-page tab. Along with that, we'll also see how to configure it so that the data gets transferred in the appropriate cells.